Hey, baseball fans. Well, would you consider this year's wildcard series anticlimactic? I mean, they all ended in sweeps. Of course, that's going to happen when it's two out of three, but still. Even, la- uh, one, even one series from last year ended in three, ended in, uh, three games. But, um, but, yeah, we got sweeps all around. It was um, the um, Rangers, the Twins. Diamondbacks and the Phillies who all advanced. Now, Texas, they really shut down Tampa. And Tampa, it's the same problem they had last year. They couldn't score runs. One run in the series, just like they had one run in the series last year. They've scored two runs in their last 42 postseason innings. That is not going to do it. And I seriously think Kevin Cash is going to get fired because a manager is supposed to fix these things and it's still not fixed. Great, great start, great season, wasted. Yeah, they got they got to, they're gonna fire him, and uh, it's, it's for the most part it's not his fault, but you need to fix a thing like that. Uh, Minnesota, congratulations to them. Though. I was pulling for Toronto, but Minnesota not only ended their long postseason game losing streak, they advanced for the first time in 21 years. The, uh, when they won Game One, that was their first win. That was their first time they won a postseason game since. Um, the 04 game one American League Division Series against the Yankees at the old stadium. That's how old that streak is. It was the old place. And um, plus the Montreal Expos were existed. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> um, but yeah. Um, and yet, yeah, and the Twins, when they won game two, they won a series for the first time since 02. The AODS against um, Oakland. And Toronto, oh boy, something. At least they didn't blow 8-1 this time. But, um, yeah, the Diamondbacks, they won in comeback fashion because Milwaukee had leads and they didn't finish. And Philly beat Miami because Miami was just outmatched. Uh, uh, they should be proud that they made it, to, made it to this postseason. We might see them back in it again, especially if they add, like, another, like, big piece. We might see them win a division for the first time in their franchise history. Amazing. They never won a division, but they won two World Series. That's fascinating. But, um, but yeah, so, as a result, we've got the, or we got the Rangers going to Baltimore to face the Orioles in that best of five division series. Of course, the last time they faced each other in the postseason, it was, it was in the first ever wildcard game, the first, first ever AL wildcard game, which the Orioles won, in Arlington, no less. Uh, and then we got the Twins going to, uh, facing the Astros in that series, and, <laughs> oh boy. The only the only thing sticking out in that series is Correa is going to face his old team, but Minnesota's going to get killed. I can go, I can pull for him, and hope Houston gets knocked down a few pegs, but Houston's going to kill the Twins. I just know it. In the National League, we got a rematch: Phillies and Braves. They're going to face each other. Uh, of course, last year was Philly upsetting the then defending champion Braves, and of course they went on to the World Series after winning the pennant against San Diego. And in the other series in the National League, it's the Diamondbacks and the Dodgers. The Diamondbacks kind of have a happy-to-be-there feel. It worked for Philly, it worked for them. So here's my predictions. I'm going to make my predictions. Right. I didn't make my wild card predictions. I posted them on social media and stuff, but I didn't make them publicly. But I was off. <laughs> as far as who who's going to win them, I was... Actually, no, I think I did pick the Rangers, so I was 2-2. Two 2-4. Two, two for two, two for batting 500. But, um... As far as my division series picks in the American League, I'll say Orioles and I'll say Orioles and five because I think that's going to be a long series. Orioles and five and Astros sweep. I can't see Minnesota winning a single game in this series. As for the National League, I'll say I think the Braves are going to get this this time. I think they learned from last year, so I'll say Braves and five and Dodgers and four. I can see I can see the Diamondbacks win a game. I could see them stealing game one. <laughs> If possible. That's happened before. But yeah, so to recap. Orioles in five. Astros sweep. Braves in five. Um, Dodgers in four. Those are my picks. And um, yeah, so, so um, that's going to be interesting. So that's my recap of the wild card series. Like I said, it was, they all went in sweeps. Of course, it's two out of three. That's going to happen. But um, yeah, so... I'm really, very excited for the division series because I, I still remember what used to be the first round. Now it's the second round. But yeah, the division series is going to be good. That best of five series, it starts tomorrow. 
uh, uh, Saturday night with four game ones. Uh, to the American League on Fox, Fox Sports One, the National League on TBS. That's the way it's going to be for the LDS and the LCS. Of course, the World Series is going to be on Fox at the time. So, again, that's our recap of the Division Series. If you like this video, click the like button. If you're on YouTube, click subscribe if you want more. If you're on TikTok, feel free to hit that follow button. Uh, my four stories on Vocal will be featured about the eliminated teams. Check them out when you can. And the next time I'll be, uh, I'll be on here publicly. I will recap week five. We talked week we're week five already. It's about the month of October. So I'll recap week five and I'll, and, I'll, and as far as baseball, I'll recap the division series once it ends. So um, stay tuned.